In the newer versions of ACT, you have the ability to create an activity from a message in your Outlook inbox with the associated contact in your ACT database. ACT does this by using the email address found in the incoming email and the email you entered for the contact in ACT to determine which record to use for creating the activity. I have a message here in ACT from Lance asking for a meeting tomorrow at 10 a.m. to discuss the proposal that I sent. I'll just select the email and click, click on the Create Act Activity, the one that looks like the shaking hands, in Act. Once I click on it, it'll display a Schedule Activity dialog box. Notice that it found Lance's name and has already started the scheduling and activity meeting with Lance in Act. Notice also that it took the regarding from the subject line, so it's the same, and the details repeat the entire contents of the email that he sent. Now all I have to do is select tomorrow's date, check to be sure that at 10 a.m. I have something available, which I did, and click OK. Now I can go ahead and delete that email from my inbox. What? Let's go check on that act and make sure that it's there. Look up Lance Parker. Look at the Activities tab. And sure enough, there it is scheduled for tomorrow at 10 a.m. Now all I have to do is let Lance know that that's a perfect time for a meeting. This has been a great way f feature for me to keep track of creating appointments from Outlook, making sure that things keep from falling through the cracks, and for scheduling follow-up activities with my clients and prospects.